How did you feel when you so badly let down your country by missing that penalty? <laughs> Your fucking German mate's got in again, hasn't he? <laughs> I just... Now, obviously, now look. Now, first of all, let me put something straight here. The guys here will never, ever, ever, never, ever know the pressure of a penalty in front of a big crowd. All right? Even in a Division Four, Southern League, Isthmian League, all them leagues match, but playing for your country in the 1990 World Cup, that is pressure. Okay, away you go. I just remember thinking to myself as I walked up to take it, well, there'll be another one along in about six years, so if I don't score this one, I'll score in six years. Did you? Was it, was it, I mean, listen, everyone knows you as, everyone sees you like as a psycho, hard man, very focused, very visioned. You're walking up there, seriously, Semi-final, what are you thinking? Seriously, Stu, what's going through your mind? Seriously. In all honesty, we're, we're that close to getting to a World Cup final. Yeah. The team haven't been to a World Cup since 66. Sure. Uh, when they'll get there again, God only knows. Um, and you just thought, we've got a hell of a chance of getting there. And we knew if we beat the Germans, we'd have probably won the final. Because yeah. I don't think the Argentinians would be particularly strong. So, no. just focused on winning it. Yeah. Which we did. How did you feel after that moment? You've, you've missed the penalty. How did you feel after? The, your, your immediate reaction, you've, you, it's gone wide, gone over, you've missed it. What do you now think? What's going through your mind? Um, shh, 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 please. Well, if you want a bit of seriousness... Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Because uh, it, 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 this, is, this is, you know, people pay money to hear stuff like this. You wouldn't normally get a conversation with someone like yourself in, in a situation like that. So what was you thinking after that penalty? Please. You feel as though you've had every chance to get into the World Cup final and your penalties put your country out. Yeah. I had to go into a drugs test with two Germans and Shilton afterwards. So three Germans. You know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shilton had a quick piss and left. He left me with the two crowds for about two and a half hours, yeah. um, which was fun. And then cried all the way back on the coach to the team hotel. And believe me, yeah, absolutely. They don't hear us. Yeah. And then the following season, Following season, when everyone said they were tired and from the World Cup, I had my best season for Forest. Yeah. Because I'd say it improved. So Absolutely. Taught me a good lesson. Uh, good for you, mate. Stuart Pearce, what about that? There you go. Very candid, very passionate. Well, that's what you get when you're in the middle of the Premier League. And I believe you changed your boot sponsor after that as well, because at the time you was wearing Puma Crowdfinders. Is that correct? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. So, <laughs> took a gamble with that one, didn't you? Eh? Here we go. Great answer, thanks, Stuart. Really appreciate that. We really do. Honestly, uh, honesty is the best policy, of course, unless you're in insurance.